Hello, I am Samantha Sunderland, and this is my reflection vlog over my informative speech presentation. Um, the purpose of my speech was to inform others about the topic of homelessness in America. Going into the speech, I felt really confident with the information that I had, but I wasn't really confident in how I was going to deliver this information, so I kind of felt a little nervous on that part. Um, I used Speaker's Ethos by having a really good knowledge of the information that I was presenting and by retrieving that information from reliable sources, which kind of gave me speaker credibility. I think that my technology was well prepared for this presentation. Um, I used the technology to the best of my ability, so I'm not really sure what I could have done better or differently, but I am definitely open to suggestions on that because I'm not very technologically savvy, I guess you could say. Um, when I was making the PowerPoint, I kept in mind that I wanted a professional design and layout and that I didn't want to put too many words on each PowerPoint slide. Um, a tip I would give is don't put paragraphs of text on your slides of PowerPoint, slides of your PowerPoint because you want to kind of just put a few words of on you know each bulleted list so that way you can better speak about it rather than having everybody read about it on the um, slide. And another tip I would give is use a color scheme and design layout that will best suit the topic you're talking about. You don't want something kind of crazy if you're talking about a serious topic. You want you know your design to fit what you were discussing. Um, my introduction felt really natural to me. I think that by asking the question, it kind of eased me into the information that I was about to give. Something that felt really odd to me, though, were my transitions. I wasn't really sure how to kind of use my transitions in the PowerPoint setting, so I felt really unnatural when I would move from point to point. When I was considering my audience, I thought about, you know, presenting it to teens and adults who were curious about learning more about homelessness. Um... My introduction, like I said before, worked really well for me. I really enjoyed asking that question because it kind of interacted with, you know, allowed me to interact with my audience a little bit, even though it was not in an audience setting. Something that didn't work for me, though, like I stated before, too, is my transitions. They were kind of rocky, and I think one way I could improve this is by setting up my PowerPoint differently to better accommodate those transitions. Um... In chapter 13 on page 102, as to relate um, this experience to a concept we read about, was it states that the best way to get an informative speech across um, to your audience that is about a concept, in my case about homelessness, is to use an example. And in my introduction, I did use an example which kind of better allowed me to get my point across for what I was talking about to my audience. Thank you for listening and I hope you enjoyed.